Young, this is Ray from Murray Chevrolet. It's been a while since I've done any videos for you guys. Stock has been low, but thank goodness we're starting to get stock in quickly. So if you see a vehicle that you like, be quick. Now this is a 2021 Chevy Blazer. This is the Premier, not the same as the RS. A little bit more chrome on this one. If that's, if that's what you like, this is the perfect vehicle for you. This one is a pewter metallic. That's a new color for 21 as well. It's very difficult to see with the, with the camera, but it absolutely speckles in the, uh, the sunlight. On there, you can see it's got the LED running on the front as well. And it's got the HIDs below there. Looking on the front, it's also got the black bow tie on there as well. Just a, just a point, most Chevy vehicles have got this now, but this here is where you would put your block heater. So there's a separate cable in the back, uh, a cord that goes in the back, and it just plugs into there, very convenient. I've not used mine yet. I've owned one of these vehicles for the last nine months, by the way, and I can't fault it at all. It's absolutely superb on the gas. At one stage going towards Codale, I think it was 3.8 liters for 100 kilometers. That was in V4 mode. This vehicle could drop down from V6 down to um, V4. And with a 3.6 matched with a 10 speed transmission, extremely powerful yeah but you don't have the high fuel consumption that you would think it's really good on the gas my average on this one is probably around seven seven eight and in and around town it's higher to eight going back and forth from codale i can sit there on seven liters for 100 if i'm doing 100 k's an hour that is look at the wheels on the side there's a 21 inch on the side of there very elegantly done the blazer sign Looking onto the side of the headlamps, um, sorry, the rear view mirror there, you can see that little indicator there. That's going to be for your sides on blind alert. Very handy for when you've got a vehicle alongside you, say down Mayor McGrath, and you can't see where the vehicle is. That would illuminate to let you know where it is. As with most modern vehicles that the Chevy is selling now, one press will lock the door, one press will open it. Looking on the interior, I'm going to get Peter to look inside there. I'm going to go to the passenger seat. Beautiful leather inside of here. You've got the accent and the stitching and two-tone as well. Extremely elegant looking. You're going to put your foot on the brake, Peter. Does that get you to do a bit of work as a cameraman? We'll get you inside here. Starting the vehicle up, it's probably going to be in demo mode, and it is. Embedded navigation, heated steering wheel, heated seats. Also in the rear, it's got heated seats as well. You can also have cool seats in the front as well. Wireless charging, and also wireless Apple CarPlay and, um, and Android Auto. One thing I love about this is the camera angles. You've got various camera angles of what you can see. If you are up into, it won't do it because the doors are closed. That'll be the hitch. That'll be the front of the vehicle. So tight, tight spots. I always don't like banging up to the front of a curb. So I always use this to make sure that I'm not gonna get uh, any damage to them beautiful rims. Now this has got adaptive cruise control, it's also got automatic braking and automatic braking in the rear and it also recognises pedestrians, both front and rear. It's, um, it's quite funny because when you drive past somebody and they're crossing on a crosswalk, a little picture of a green man illuminates on the centre dash. Rear stream live camera, takes a bit of getting used to but once, it, once you get used to it, I found it, how did I ever manage without it before there? Garage door openers, memory seats. Now this is, like I said, 3.6 and it's got the 10 speed transmission. It's very difficult to see in this light, but you've got two wheel drive, which does exactly what you think it does. Four wheel, sport mode, mountain mode and trailer mode. This vehicle will tow 4,500 pounds. Now you've, on the trailer in mode, it does, it does like what a truck says, it'll move up through the gears quicker and it'll help to slow down quicker. Well, let's move it onto the back.
This has actually got carrying two big bags of shopping out of Costco. You put your foot underneath there and it will open. Stacks of space in the back of this. Um, I'm doing a little bit of home renovation and just, it wasn't easy, but just, I got myself a piece of um, MDF, what do you call it in this country, the big, the big ply boards. That went in the back just. Um, but the space between there is more than enough to do your groceries, more than enough to get whatever you need in there. Super, super um, spacious in the back of the vehicle. Looking down there, if you do require a little bit more storage space for maybe odds and things that you, you carry around inside here as well. It's got a space over wheel inside there. Hidden down below, you can't see it, but underneath that there, there's going to be a tow hitch on the vehicle as well. Very nice if you do want to tow on it uh, on the back. Again, if you want to, you can use the control to get it closed. I think to summarize on this, after only one for nearly a year, it fits me perfectly. An Equinox for me, for my personal use, was too small. I didn't need the three rows of seats. This is perfect. And it's nice when you're driving down the highway and people actually look round and look at your car. It feels great that I've got a, a such, such a nice vehicle. If this isn't your shade of, um, of blazer, we do have another Premier there. That one is in silver and we have the RS in black as well. As I said, stock was really low. It's starting to get up. We're going to get more vehicles in. I can't stress enough, if you see a vehicle that you like, get in, get a test drive, get a test drive booked and get it bought. 403 328 1101. Have yourself a great day. Thankfully, summer's here. I hope to see you soon. Thank you. Bye-bye.